Hey indie filmmakers, Griffin here in Bowling Green, Kentucky, where it is T minus 13 minutes until the moon begins to cross over the sun, and about an hour and a half until a total solar eclipse. I traveled from New York to Western Kentucky University to be in the path of the totality, meaning for the first time in my life, I'd be under the shadow of the moon. Hey, is anyone here excited? <laughs> Even at 93 million miles away, our sun is really bright. So I purchased a big roll of solar safety film. It reflects 99.999% of light, so I can capture shots like this. I made a few DIY filters, including this one I'm using on my 35 to 100 millimeter lens. But to get even tighter shots, Panasonic let me borrow their new 100 to 400 millimeter lens. I taped on a solar filter designed for a telescope, and even though its diameter is smaller than the lens, I actually don't see vignetting because everything is black but the sun. I set up my camera to shoot a time lapse, one photo every 18 seconds over a 90 minute period. At that long interval, the sun moves pretty quickly. So here's what I actually captured. It looks like Pac-Man. And this is after I manually stabilized it. Right now, we are seeing the shadow of the moon that's coming through the trees, and it's the shape of the eclipse. It already feels cooler. I don't know, maybe just psychosomatic, but. Just minutes before the moon completely blacked out the sun, I had a crazy idea. What if I put my drone up in the air to capture the shift to darkness as it happens? As we nearly entered totality, I flipped off my solar filters to capture the sun's corona, the plasma projected from the star's surface. They were going nuts <laughs> and very excited. I raised my ISO to pretty much like nighttime shooting, almost what we call blue hour. In Bowling Green, we experienced 55 seconds of totality. It kind of stunned the heck out of me and I feel kind of disoriented still, <laughs> to be honest. Once the diamond ring effect bloomed big enough, I reattached my solar filters so I could capture the rest. Let's come back. Having everybody together to experience this, you know, incredible uh, rare thing was a really, really special moment for us. Mm -hmm. 